Hi, today we're going to make hot, cold, spicy noodles. And what's interesting about these is that they are indeed hot and spicy, yet they're also chilled. So it makes a very interesting contrast. We'll start with a package of ramen noodles. We're not going to use the uh, flavor packet this time. And we'll just put those into some boiling water. Just a couple cups of boiling water. And we're going to let those cook for about two minutes. And while they're doing that, I'll go over the ingredients for the flavoring. So for the noodles, what we have is we're going to have two tablespoons of sh sugar. We're going to have a quarter cup of tahini, which is basically ground cinnamon seed. It's kind of like a, uh, well, it's kind of like a very thin uh, nut to butter. We're going to have a tablespoon of hot sesame oil. So this is uh, toasted sesame oil that has uh, red pepper in it. And we'll have some uh, toasted sesame seeds. And finally, at the end, we'll add some fresh green onions or scallions. And these have come right out of the garden. So they're going to be nice and fresh. So, there we go. And what we'll be doing is we'll be, when these have softened up a little bit, what we'll do is we'll take them and we'll drain them. And what we'll do is we'll put them very quickly into a, a cold water bath, which will then cool them off very quickly. And then after that, we'll drain them and then we'll add our ingredients. And the order of the ingredients will be very important, and you'll see why in a minute. So these noodles have pretty much softened up. As I said, it will take a couple minutes. And you don't want them to be done too much. You want them to be al dente which is basically um, firm to the teeth. So let's go over here now. And we'll go over to the sink. And I'm going to drain those. There we go. Just like that. And then we're going to cool them off very quickly. This is a cold water bath. Just make sure these are cooling off nicely. That's great. So the noodles have cooled off, and we'll just kind of give them one more rinse. And then we'll put them back into our pan. And we'll take them back over here to the preparation area. Now the first thing we're going to put in is we're going to put in our sugar. And the reason we want to do that first is we want to make sure that the sugar gets completely dissolved. There we go. And it won't take very long for, that, for it to dissolve. So just like that, and as soon as you've kind of seen that all the granules are gone, you'll be all set. So you can see there's no granules left in there. The next thing we'll put in is we'll put in our quarter cup of tahini for flavoring. Now this dish can be used certainly as a, uh, as a main dish. But it also makes a really nice kind of a uh, little appetizer. You can kind of think of it as a um, as a kind of pasta salad. There we go. And so that gets mixed in. And now the next ingredient will be the hot sesame oil. And you're going to have to kind of experiment with the flavor on this one. About probably a teaspoon or one package is going to be plenty. It's going to be quite spicy. So we'll mix that in. And la 
last thing we'll put in before we put in the scallions is we'll put in just a touch of toasted sesame seeds. We'll mix those in. There we go. And the last piece will be the first scallions. And you have a choice here. You can just put the scallions in. Or what you can do is you can take the scallions and you can give them a little squeeze before you place them into the noodles. And what that will do is that will kind of distribute the flavor of the scallions right into the noodles. Yeah. And we'll just put those right into And there you have cold, spicy sesame noodles. Let's see if these how these are. They are spicy and they are cold. Thank you for joining us and we'll see you next time.